another project that I'm working on um, yeah this one kind of came to me after I've been riding that little farm bike around a lot it was getting really good mileage and range and I started doing some experiments to try and figure out like you know how much energy it was really using per mile so I would gear up uh, and head out for like a 15 mile ride each time and kind of log how much energy it was used how many amps were used per piece and started getting some really low numbers like 20 watt hours per um, mile and that means how much energy it used per mile which would be kind of like miles per gallon but there's no gallons so um, I had this great idea where I think I can probably develop a vehicle that can go well over a thousand miles per tank and have it be like a little mini bike so uh, starting off with this little generator it's 40 cc's from Home Depot it can pump out 400 watts continuous which is a little low but I think we can kind of buffer it by running it um, at a higher load for a shorter period of time to charge the battery up. Um, the whole thing is this is kind of like a Chevy Volt. It's going to be a range extender. So it's going to have a gasoline engine running a charger to charge a battery to run the drivetrain. So it's an electric bike, but it has an onboard gas powered um, charger for the battery. So all my calculations show it should be upwards of like 1500 miles per tank. I'm going to have a pretty big tank on it. So it's gonna be a fun little project. I'm gonna be doing some aerodynamics, some um, fabrication, some modification of drivetrains, and hopefully it shouldn't take too long to keep this thing down to like less than a couple weeks. And uh, yeah, after that, maybe I'll take an epic road trip on it and go a thousand miles on a mini bike on one tank. So stay tuned. Hope you enjoy the video.
how comfortable that looks. <laughs> yep. All right, everyone. Well, thank you so much. I think that's going to be it for this video. That was about a week's worth of work on this little chassis here, and it's almost close to running. But I got to finish up some of the gas tanks and do some of the wiring. So we're going to send this into part two. You know, make sure you subscribe, comment, like, and so that way you can follow along and check out the rest of this build. So thanks so much for watching once again. See you guys soon. sure you subscribe comment like and smash that ring the bell button oh. Oh. <laughs> but really do that.